Good day to Dr. Iquan. We are from Grid 2 and our project title is Smart Bin, which can separate dry and wet waste. My name is Sifia and I'm the one who will be explaining on the circuit design part. As you can see, we are using Proteus to design our circuit and simulate it. There are five components for our project, which are the Arduino Uno board, which is the brain of the project, a um, soil moisture and task sensor, which is the analog and digital input of the project, a server motor, and lastly, a 16 times two LCD display, which is the display output of our project. So for your information, the task sensor is connected to a logistic, which represents the presence of the waste. So when the logistic is zero, it represents that the, there is no waste presence. So when it is one, it means that there is waste. As for soil moisture sensor, it is connected to a potential meter. The potential meter represents the weight level of the waste. So when the potential meter is zero percent, this means that the waste is dry, and if it is more than zero percent, it means that the waste is wet. As you can see, the soil moisture sensor is connected to an LC filter to cut off to cut off frequency changes. This LC filter is not required for the hardware constructions. So now let's start the simulations. So when the simulation is started, it will show welcome engineer on the first line, then get ready on the second line. After that, it will, it will scroll from left to the right, then to the left. Then next, it will show the west type. Since, since there is no waste on the torch sensor, so it will show no, and the server model is in zero degrees, which means it is neutral state. So next, when the torch sensor is touched and the potential meter is zero percent, which means that the waste is dry, it will display dry on the LCD display and the servo model will be in 180 degrees, which will slide to the right. So then when, so then if we adjust the, the weight level on the potential meter, for example, if it is on 52%, it will show that the waste type is wet waste and the server motor will turns to 90 degrees and slide to the left. And that's all for the circuit design part. Hello and a good day. My name is Adiran Ramesh and my matrix number is EA19069. I would like to thank Dr. Ikwan for giving me this wonderful opportunity to present our project which is Smart Segregator. Now I'm going to explain about the programming part. I'm using Arduino IDE. 2.0.0 version and the library are server.h and liquid crystal i2c.h the liquid crystal which is the LCD is declared here and the servo pin is 13 the servo pin is connected to the pin 13 moisture sensor is connected to A0 pin charge sensor is connected to A1 pin the moisture sensor is 0 and when touch is false is also declared for the white setup LCD backlit is enabled and the cursor is at, at 00, 00 where the LCD will print welcome engineer at 00. 00. After a delay of 200 milliseconds, the cursor is at, at 01 and the LCD will print get ready. After a 200 millisecond delay, the LCD display will scroll to the left. As we can see here, we are using 16 as there are 16 alphabets here. After the LCD display will scroll at a pace of 230 millisecond and the LCD display will scroll to the right and we are using 32 as 16 times 2 which is the highest for the helper words to move from the right to the left again for the left hand side part we are using 16 at a pace of 230 millisecond also 
then LCD is clear and the cursor is set at 0, 0 and the LCD will be printed page type at the cursor 0, 0. The server is also declared and the pin mode moisture sensor is set as input and the touch sensor is set also as input. Now the void loop will begin where the moisture sensor is read as analog read and the touch sensor will be read as digital read on the Arduino. If moisture sensor is detected more than zero and touch sensor is true, the servo motor and the LCD will show as wet and the servo motor will go to the left hand side. If, else if when the moisture sensor is less than or equal to zero and the touch sensor is true, the LCD will print dry and the servo writing at zero. Lastly, when the servo write at 90 and there is no waste at all, the cursor is set at 0, 1 and the LCD print will show no. That's all from me. Thank you. Hello, good day. My name is Harriuta Sanaki Albert. My matrix ID is EA19070. First and foremost, I would like to thank Dr. Ikwan for giving this opportunity to explain our project, which is titled as Smart Segregator. As you can see from here, this is the hardware of our project. So now I'm going to explain you the input of our project that we used. This is touch sensor and this is moisture sensor and this is the moisture sensor module that we placed over here and this is LCD 7 segment and this is micro servo and the Arduino and breadboard we put inside a closed box to ensure that the, co the connection and the wire are tidy. As you can see from here, the bottom part we use acrylic board 5mm and on the acrylic board we use a plastic cover and we, we, we use hot, gland, hot glue gun to, gun, uh, to glue it. And this is micro servo that we put up, up bottom of this plastic cover and we seal with the hot glue gun. This is the ruler. We drill a hole in this ruler to and we connect the servo motor to in to the cupboard here. Yeah. Initially, we plan to use two millimeter acrylic board instead of this cupboard. But the challenges that we face on this project is the two millimeter cupboard is heavy and the micro servo cannot withstand the weight of the two millimeter board. Instead of that we try to improvise our hardware to use this uh, cupboard which is lighter than the hard click board. Now we are going to simulate our hardware. From this LCD, we are going to see the LCD will display uh, welcome engineer get ready and it will blink once. After the blinking, the LCD will display the welcome engineer get ready will move to the left, right and left. After the moving the LCD will display what waste type we are going to use. For example, waste type. The, if the waste type is wet, it will go. To, it will show wet. If the waste type is uh, dry, it will show dry. When there is a no waste uh, over there, it will show no. Now we are going to power the Arduino. As you can see from here, the right hand side is a dry waste and the left hand side is a wet waste. So when there's no waste on this cupboard, the LCD will display as a no. For example, we go, I'm going to use this dry waste. This is a dry tissue I'm going to put on the sensor and let's see what happened to the system. As the LCD will display as a dry. So we are going to put this uh, wet tissue, this uh, wet tissue I am going to put on the sensor and we will see what happened to the system. As you can see from the display, the display shown as a uh, wet. Our simulation is comes to the end and that's all from me. Thank you.